Hello everyone, welcome to Be Yourself and this is Nithi. So today I'm going to show you how to do a Unity remote setup for your Android device. So first of all, you have to go to uh, Google Play and search Unity Remote 4. So let me show you uh, in the desktop, Google Play and search for Unity Remote. Oh my God, my internet. So sorry. Unity. What's going on? Unity remote oh you can see here the unity remote 4 so it's already installed in my device so just install it i'm gonna give the link in my description so no worries and after installing it uh, you can see this one select a device to use and go to edit project setting editor in unity so open unity i have one demo project for you so i will go to edit then project setting then editor and choose any any android device and one more thing after doing this go to my computer right click manage device and search for android device yeah if you will get this one it's okay no worries if you didn't then you have to do one thing suppose you have any device like asus okay then you have to do one thing Suppose you want a uh, ADB driver for ASUS, then type ASUS ADB Android ADB driver. Yeah, go for it. The first link and download this one. Oh, this one, yeah, download this one. Actually, I have already downloaded this one, so I'm not going to download it again. So let me tell you how do you set up for any other device if you don't get the Android device here just you will get one thing portable device the right click on it update driver and go for browse my computer for driver software it's a manual update and so it's good for it where you have downloaded it and just click ok and the next 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 and it's a very simple process after that you will get your android device here and then connect your phone with the usb cable to your system then you are ready to use it so it's a very simple process let me show you how it will work so i'm gonna play this one oh sorry i have to open my unity remote so just just a minute yeah i open my unity mode for and just click play and wait for some time you can see so it is working yay <laughs> so thank you very much uh, I forgot one thing uh, to complete full action you have to do one more thing uh, just go to the mobile setting and go for developer option if you didn't get the developer option then you have to go to about uh, so, sorry uh, let me check once about phone I think yeah about phone and uh, inside about phone tap seven times on a build number then you will become a developer so we'll get the developer option and inside the developer option you have to go for you have to turn on uh, USB debugging, debugging and stay awake. Okay, and actually I've also given the step-by-step -step procedure in the description. So just follow it. Okay, bye-bye. See you next time.